Uh, climb up all those ladders to save Sylvia. Uh-oh. I don't like the smile from the beast. <laughs> a little, uh, rubbing sleep out of his eyes. He seems a little excited. I don't like, the more the more he pays attention, the more nervous I get for the opponents of Daigo. But Gamer B has shown he can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with this guy, but has also at the same time suffered some of the most stinging losses. Yeah. Including the famous gif where he got uppercut like 97 times in a <laughs> yeah. row. Making the wrong read over and over again. But he did manage to defeat Daigo finally at South by Southwest. Exactly. He right. overcame a bunch of his demons there. He beat Daigo, he beat Tokido, two players that he said he very rarely defeats. Yeah. Went to training stage. I almost thought he went to Volcanic Rim. I was like, no. <laughs> <laughs> Only one person on the planet is happy about that. Shout outs to Mr. Ultra David. <laughs> but he's wrong. <laughs> All right, moving on. Yo. <laughs> All right, Dago trying to establish the early fireball dominance, saying, this is how I choose to dance this round. This is this the game that he's been playing, right? I mean, he did this to uh, wow. look Gustavo as well. The spacing is something special. Okay, he's going to go for the push here. Okay, I like the wake-up uppercut from Gamer B. The spacing right outside of roundhouse range. Yep. Where it's just Ooh. really... Oh, man. Done. Man. Done. Daigo says, congratulations to all of your victories, but no. I'm qualifying for Capcom Cup right here, right now. What are you going to do about it, Gamer B? Oh, oh wow. wow, perfect distancing, so it was only one hit, stand round house. Perfect read on that crowd turn, that stand round house. Stun time? Oh no, okay, oh, yeah, now it's done. It is. This is going to be a perfect for Mad Cat. It's a perfect. Yeah. yeah. Congratulations, Gamer B, for working your way all the way up here. Perfect. Now face the true final boss. Wow. Yeah, that was... Really impressive reads. Daigo looking on form here. Of late, he's been looking weaker. People are saying now, you know, he's not so good in these tournament formats. He's only good in long sets, but... Do you realize how many how many years in a row I've heard that about Daigo, <laughs> only to watch him rise from the grave over and over again? It's unbelievable. But, yeah, his spacing here has been perfect. That was really nice stuff. Yeah. But here comes Gamer B. I think the simpler he can get, yeah, with the blender, I think the happier he'll be. Daigo trying to reset that distance. Oh my gosh! Yeah. And that is the power of Evil Ryu. All he needs to do is catch you with that one low forward if he has two bars. Or focusing your game on that. It takes a lot of mental energy to try and get that as a punish. Alright, like that jump in timing. Here we go, Gamer B. Getting some good damage on the corner. And Daigo, like I said, a lot of just very yeah. interrupting uppercuts that he's been throwing out. Nice completion there from Gamer B. There's the distance. Yeah, Gamer B just has to play patience now. Oh, he tried to uppercut, missed it. Yeah, Gamer, Gamer B, B closed it, out. it was a dangerous situation because Gamer B was, you know, he's, I could tell he has a lot of adrenaline flowing yeah. in him right now. And, and I don't know though, because he tried that against Bon Chan when he stayed back and then he paid for it too. It can cut both ways, absolutely. Yeah. Oh, wow. Nice change of the direction. Yeah, it's like you said, that's why you do the EX one to <laughs> stop that, but it still worked anyway. Sick of timings. And yeah, that's the distance he wants, unless he chooses to come in with the forward. Oh, you can chain that so late and still the, get the Yeah, super combo. late chain, yeah. Oh, he tried to what? uppercut, but it didn't come out. It came out as crouching forward instead. He wanted that uppercut at ABC, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, no. What? Oh, and he did the quick rise, too. Into yeah. the fireball. Daigo Umahara now at tournament game. Just like that. And you called Gamer B a button Z player. And exactly, you can see that in the end of that round. Had he not been so quick to tap buttons, which, of course, you wouldn't be if you were thinking through that situation. He had time to react to that. But he didn't, and woke up right into the fireball. Very small kind of thing, but I think good evidence of the, of the style he described. Okay, Gamer B gets the anti-air that time, but here comes Daigo. Oh no! What? A reset, so that's going to be good. And Daigo goes aggressive, because he wanted the stun. He wanted the dizzy, but... And now it's gone, so he can chill a little bit, yep. stand back, play this roundhouse, standing roundhouse game dance. Oh, he tried the focus. Yeah, but the ground one is the armor breaker. Only the air one. Here we go.
Gamer B taking his first round against Daigo Humara. I don't like the facial expression on Gamer B. It looks more like, eh, what's the point? One round, but hopefully that's not the case. Hopefully he has the mental fortitude. He has gone through so much struggle yes, and strife here. You want to let here. it go right now. Yes. Yeah. Walking in the fireballs like that is not a good sign. Oh, Ooh. here we go. A little bit of a whiff. Gamer B has been making really strong decisions so far with the standing roundhouse. Daigo is controlling that game before and has uh, basically had to surrender it so far. But at the same time, standing around house isn't going to win you matches if the opponent's not throwing anything out. Oh, here we go. Daigo gets that low forward fireball again. It's been the difference maker. Oh, and yeah. The juggle. Oh, here we Ooh, go. That's a possibility. Oh, he's going for the super Big wow. damage. Man, also a big risk because if he loses this round, he loses all of his resources. Oh, Just like that. No. That was too much. I would have liked to have seen maybe a red focus instead. Oh, or your prediction or... of doom has come to pass, James. This could be Gamer B's last round and with here no at NCR resources. 2015. But it's a good start for Gamer B. Okay, pulled up a cut, a little off. Maybe, maybe a hope. Oh wow! What? what? He's been holding that in reserve the whole time. Oh my God! And here we go. Close to stun. Oh. He... Oh, he wanted to get him with that. Oh, okay, great patience from Gamer B. Daigo just swinging at the fences saying, I want my stun. Oh, and that should do it right there. Daigo Umahara here at Northern California Regionals is qualified into the Capcom Cup for de in December. Automatically qualified just like that. Great showing from Gamer B, but yeah, Daigo again just turned up the volume on him there at the end and said, no, we are playing at a different level than you're ready for right at this moment. And yeah. Amazing play. Interrupting uppercuts that he's been throwing out. Nice completion there from Gamer B. There's the distance. Yeah, Gamer B just has to play patience now. Oh, he tried to uppercut, missed it. Yeah, Gamer, Gamer B, B closed it out. It was a dangerous situation because Gamer B was, you know, he's. I could tell he has a lot of adrenaline flowing yes. in him right now. And and I don't know though, because he tried that against Bon Chan when he stayed back, and then he paid for it too. It can cut both ways. Absolutely. Yeah. Oh wow. Nice change of the direction. Yeah, it's like you said, that's why you do the EX one to <laughs> stop that, but it still worked anyway. Secret timings. Yeah, that's the distance he wants. Unless he chooses to come in with the forward. Oh! You can chain that so late and still a, get the Yeah, super combo. late chain, yeah. Oh, he tried to what? uppercut, but it didn't come out. It came out as crouching forward instead. He wanted that uppercut at ABC, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, no. What? Oh, and he did. Fireball dominance, saying, this is how I choose to dance this round. This is this the game respond? that he's been playing, right? I mean, he did this to uh, wow. Gustavo as well. The spacing is something special. Okay, he's going to go for the push here. Okay, I like the wake up uppercut from Gamer B. The spacing right outside of roundhouse range. Yep. Where it's just really Ooh. Oh, man. Done. Man. Done. Daigo says, congratulations to all of your victories, but no. I'm qualifying for Capcom Cup right here, right now. What are you going to do about it, Gamer B? Oh, oh wow. wow. Perfect distancing. So it was only one hit. Stand roundhouse. Perfect read on that crowd turn that stand roundhouse. Stun time? Oh, no. Okay, yeah, now oh, it's done. It this is going to be a perfect for Mad Cat. It's a perfect. Yeah. Congratulations, Gamer B, for working your way all the way up here. Now face the true final boss. Wow. Yeah, that was really impressive reads. Daigo looking on form here. Of late, he's been looking weaker. People are saying now, you know, he's not so good in these tournament formats. He's only good in long sets, but... Do you realize how many how many years in a row I've heard that about Daigo <laughs> only to watch him rise from the grave over and over again? It's unbelievable. But, yeah, his spacing here has been perfect. That was really nice stuff. Yeah. But here comes Gamer B. I think the simpler he can get, yeah, with the blender, I think the happier he'll be. Daigo trying to reset that distance. Oh my gosh. Yeah. And that is the power of Evil Ryu. All he needs to do is catch it with that one low forward if he has two bars. Or focusing your game on that. It takes a lot of mental energy to try and get that as a punish. Alright, like that jumping timing. Here we go, Gamer B. Getting some good damage on the corner. 
And Daigo, like I said, a lot of just very into the quick rise too, into the fireball. Daigo Umahara now at tournament game. Just like that, and you called Gamer B a button Z player, and exactly, you could see that in the end of that round. Had he not been so quick to tap buttons, which of course you wouldn't be if you were thinking through that situation, he had time to react to that, but he didn't, and woke up right into the fireball. Very small kind of thing, but I think good evidence of the, of the style that you described. Okay, Gamer B gets the anti-air that time, but here comes Daigo. Oh no! What? A reset, so that's gonna be good to And Daigo goes aggressive, because he wanted the stun. He wanted the dizzy, but... And now it's gone, so he can chill a little bit, yep. stand back, play this roundhouse, standing roundhouse game dance. Oh, he tried the focus. Yeah, but the ground one is the armor breaker. It's only the air one. Here we go! Gamer B taking his first round against Daigo Umara. I don't like the facial expression on Gamer B. It looks more like, eh, what's the point? One <laughs> round, but hopefully that's not the case. Hopefully he has the mental fortitude. He is gonna climb up all those ladders to save Sylvia. Uh oh, I don't like the smile from the beast. <laughs> a little uh, rubbing the sleep out of his eyes. He seems a little excited. I don't like the more the more he pays attention, the more nervous I get for the opponents of Daigo. But Gamer B <laughs> has shown he can go toe to toe with this guy, but has also at the same time suffered some of the most stinging losses. Yeah. Including the famous gif where he got uppercut like 97 times in a <laughs> yeah. row, making the wrong read over and over again. But he did manage to defeat Daigo finally at South by Southwest. Exactly. He right? overcame a bunch of his demons there. He beat Daigo, he beat Tokido, two players that he said he very rarely defeats. Yeah. Went to training stage. I almost thought he went to Volcanic Rim. I was like, no. <laughs> <laughs> Only one person on the planet is happy about that. Shout outs to Mr. Ultra David. <laughs> but he's wrong. <laughs> All right, moving on. Yo. <laughs> All right, Dago trying to establish the early fight.